Um, uh, Dennis, we're talking about using sex semen breeding season 23. How did 22 go? 22 went well, actually. People got on, got on well mm. last year with sex semen, by and large. Um, and I suppose, I think a big reason for that is, is they followed all the advice very well. You know. Okay, but we, we, we really got to be sure that we're not complacent this year. So uh, rules of thumb again for you know, uh, selecting heifers, selecting the maidens. So the big one with heifers really is they, they must be over their target weight. We spoke about in the previous video. So over target weight for their maintenance and on a good plane, good rising plane of nutrition really. Okay, a couple of rules for cows on the health side. So cows, I would say number one, they need to be calved a minimum of 50 days. Um, number two is body condition. So three or over really, uh, body condition. And the other one is, is that they have had no problems. So basically that they're clean, healthy, fertile cows. Yeah, and if we're really looking at then the selection within the herd, we're probably talking about that bottom 20%, the sub-performing cows, the bottom 20% cows that we're picking out of the lifetime report. Absolutely, so avoid. Obviously you want to be a bit selective when you're using sex semen. But, so avoid, avoid the poorest cows in the herd. Okay, tell me about timing, timing with sex. Timing is, is absolutely critical to get it right. So same rules apply for heifers and cows. So really they need to be gone off heat. So you're talking 12 to 20 hours after the, stand, the start of standing heat. So what that means really is if your technician is coming in the morning, they need to be, have been in standing heat the previous, um, the previous evening, maybe from lunchtime to, to, to dusk or something like that. Okay, so rule of thumb, no fresh on cows. No fresh cows, yeah. Absolutely. Just a couple of comments on Munster's choice of sex and, their, and what, what they're selecting for sex. So it's all, this, all the, the semen that sexed either in Moorpark or up in NCBC this year, so it is all sexed Ultra Plus 4M, so 4 mm. million cells in each straw. And another point is we do not sex any G1 bulls. So they're the first season sires, the young test bulls. We don't have any idea on their field fertility, so how good they are at putting cows and calf, so we don't sex them. Okay, and just a caution if people are using quite a lot of sexed, any caution on numbers of bulls to use? Yeah, the same rules apply as conventional, so use, yep. use an adequate sized team of bulls, so it's all about spreading the risk. Okay, good on you. Thanks, Dennis. Mm -hmm.